with forward pay from Appalachian Wireless, you'll avoid contracts and credit checks while taking advantage of some awesome perks, like unlimited talk, text, and three gigs of data for just $44.99, or with five gigs for a mere $59.99. Forward pay. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Stephen Alex Moore and Nathaniel Paul Haney escaped from custody in Letcher County in separate incidents. Moore on July 20th and Haney on September 1st. Both have now been captured in Alabama. Letcher Commonwealth's attorney Edison Banks said both men were entered into the National Crime Database and were caught. They'll now face felony escape charges in Letcher County. Usually the FBI's NCIC uh, does a pretty good job of keeping track of wanted persons and uh, you can run as they say but you can't hide. Both alleged escapes happened in broad daylight. Moore allegedly scaled a fence at the jail, walked across the roof of the Letcher County Courthouse, and slid down a flagpole before stealing a truck belonging to Community Trust Bank and fleeing to Knott County. He was in jail on meth-related charges. Haney was arrested at a traffic checkpoint at the Virginia-Kentucky border at Jenkins. He was left unattended in a police cruiser and managed to get out of the cruiser. He was also believed to have fled to Knott County. The Commonwealth's attorney said Haney faced a long list of criminal charges in other areas. He may take longer to get back even though he's in custody on our warrant. Once they uh, apprehended him, they found that he had other offenses of different jurisdictions. Banks said he is not surprised at the escape attempts. They find ways. They've got nothing but time on their hands, and I'm sure that uh, with that much time, these inmates constantly are thinking of ways to escape. Both men are awaiting extradition from Alabama to Kentucky. Reporting in Whitesburg for EKB News, I'm Chris Anderson.